Guns N' Roses. It's your girl Amber Rose bringing you another read. <clears throat> this here read is going to be about if you're dating a, Sagitt a Sagittarius man or guns. I'm going to give you some key points on what a Sagittarius guns like in a woman or a rose. First of all, most importantly is a Sagittarius guns love a woman or rose that has a very highly intellect. They have to be really, really strong, knowledgeable. They have to have wisdom because Sagittarius, Sagittarius are very, very wise. They love uh, people to move their imagination and um, they love people that's wise and can really speak on their level. Okay, let's jump in. First of all, when dating a Saggy Guns, he's very masculine and fiery. We're going to do the positives and the flip side, my Guns and Roses. He loves when you do something the, like the unthinkable, something a little naughty, and he loves when you keep him on his toes. He loves a woman that is unpredictable, and you have to be enthusiastic too as well, my Roses. He loves when you're ready to go at any moment, at any time. And he really loves surprises as well, my roses. You know, he's the type of person that will stop what he's doing and bring you lunch on your lunch break or send you some roses or something like that. He really loves his rose when he's very interested in her. When, when you're dating the Saggy Guns, you will never be bored. They love to travel, and they love to have fun. They're charming and intelligent and always entertainment, entertaining too as well. I'm sorry, I can't even speak. When you want to date with this person, you're going to have a lot of fun with a Sagittarius guns. But you know what, Roses? Be open for anything because them Saggy guns, they be ready to do stuff. They're very adventurous. He needs a woman that's similar to him. So if you're not ready to get out of your comfort zone, then he's not the guns for you. If you're dating a Saggy's uh, man, he wants a woman that can grow, like be open to new things that are different. He wants a woman that's flexible and always looking to grow. If you're dating a Saggy um, guns, he is a great man to go out on a limb with. Be open to expansion and allow him to encourage you every step of the way. If you're dating or interested in a Saggy Guns, he loves an intelligent woman. It turns him on the most. He wants a woman to be knowledgeable or something like him, like I said. He wants a rose that he can feel comfortable um, talking to. You know, he wants a woman that's on his, his level when he does express himself to you. You know, he wants you at least to be able to engage in the conversation that he's trying to express to you. And another important factor about uh, dating a Saggy uh, Guns is that um, he loves for you to encourage him and thank him for the things. Hold on, guns and rubber. He expects you to um, encourage him on the things that he does. Compliment him. Um, Sachi guns, um, they love to keep their footwear clean. They love like nice shoes, expensive things. They're hard workers. They're go-getters. They will hustle, whatever. They got to do whatever they will provide. They're a good provider. Yeah. Um, he don't like a lot of heavy uh, energy, uh, arguing, and, you know, uh, if you're, like, moving too fast, you know, when you just started out with um, um, this, this um, Saggy Guns, he don't like you to move too fast, you know, because if he feel like he's pressured, then, you know, he's going to kind of shy away because he don't like, Saggy's don't like a whole lot of uh, <clears throat> dead energy. They love knowledge because really their focus is on their money and their home place, their stability. They're real fiery and stuff like that, but 
They don't really like a clingy woman because they love their freedom too as well. Yeah. So, they're very free-spirited and they're passionate. Like I said, they love to be happy and stuff, you know. So, if you're dating a Sagis, um guns, make sure you're very, very intelligent, wise, have wisdom, um, know how to talk to these guns, you know, have new creative ideas because they love to just do things. A lot of us Sagis work for themselves too as well, the guns. All right, let's jump right into our read, my Saggy guns. For some of you guns, you want to just talk to this person. Yeah. For some of you guys, you could have been talking to somebody while they was drinking and you was just, you know, sitting there listening, but you was kind of stuck on what they were saying to you. Yeah. A lot of you guys and roses, I mean, you like this person, you love this passion. It could be a fire sign, but if not, this person is very fiery and passionate too. Like I said, you saggy guns, y'all like this rose. Mm-hmm. A lot of you guys, you want to just work on it with this person. And for a lot of you guys, y'all really soft-spoken and very intelligent and mannerable. But, you know, some of you guys might be heartbroken because of a third-party energy. Um, you could be dealing with a Leo. But if not, you know, you just getting your strength back on what happened. A lot of you girls, like I said, you like this rose. You think she's beautiful. She could be an Aquarius. But if not, you look at her like she's a star. She's a go-getter like you. You love her passion. But some of you guys, you could be blocked and guarded. Or this person could be blocked and guarded too on what they have to say as well. Yeah. <clears throat> For a lot of you Sagis, you just want to talk to this person. Because things have been heavy on you. You know, as far as in your household, this relationship as well. Yeah, but for some of you Sagis, y'all could be dealing with a Libra. But if not, you want the truth and nothing but the truth. Because, you know, things just been heavy. And, you know, you just can't take it. For some of you uh, Sagis, you know, you've been working and putting your money up and things like that. Just been peaceful, not really bothering nobody. Taking care of home, you know, some of you guys, you own your own business. And, you know, you climbing up the ladder and you just putting your money up. Absolutely. Some of you guys, y'all looking good. Y'all looking handsome. Y'all dressing nice. Yeah. Y'all using your imagination, your mind, your intellect on things. For some of you guys, y'all could be dealing with an empress. You think that this rose is very beautiful. She's creative like you. She is the image of you. She's like a twin of you. Yeah, she's like a twin of you, my um, Sagittarius guns. Yeah, but for some of you guys, you know, you feel like somebody got secrets. Yeah, and you're using your intuition on this too as well, my guns. You could be dealing with a water sign for some. Yeah. But you turn, for some of you guys, you turned your back on love, you know, or could have turned your back on a um, water sign. But if not, you know, you decided to just focus on your place. And, you know, for some of you guys, you just want to get a new car or, you know, a new place to live. And, Y'all been looking, and it's going to come in real quick. For some of you guys, y'all could be um, into it with a Sagittarius, too. Your own sign. If not, you could be into it with a Gemini. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So you ready to move on, my guns, for some. Or something might happen quick. Let's find out. Yeah, for some of you um, girls, you just want to work on it with your roles, too. And your roles want to work on it, too, because you, um, you've you been sad about somebody putting you in a third-party situation. And for some of you guys, like I said, you could be dealing with a leader, but you're ready to hear the truth and nothing but the truth. And like I said, y'all could be in a family dynamic, and you love this person, too. Yeah, you ready to start a brand-new beginning. 
For some of you, um, Sagi Guns, you ready to go out of town, too, to travel to see this person, too. Or you like to travel as well with your mate. Yeah. For some of you, Guns and Roses, you love when you travel and make love to this person because um, that's where you might offer your love to her at somewhere at a celebration or a party. Yeah. But you love to drink with your rose and have a good time um, and talk to this rose. You could be watching her. They could be watching you. What else for my um, Saggies? Yeah, for some of you guns and roses, y'all might be planning a big celebration of some type. Um, and you're going to invite your lover or whatever. And y'all going to have a really, really good time. Y'all going to invite your f family and friends. Mm -hmm. Or you might take this rose somewhere real fancy and nice. Because it is y'all birthday. Happy birthday, my Saggies. My brother's birthday was this month. You know I'm sending a shout out to my brother, Rick. Yeah. Y'all might have had a good celebration and good love and passion. Yeah, and for some of you girls and roses, y'all blocking out other suitors too as well. Mm-hmm. Yeah, for some of you guys and roses, y'all really had a good time on y'all birthday. Y'all really got messed up. Y'all spent some money, too. Yeah, y'all was probably with your mate. Y'all had some good love, and it was fiery and passionate, too, as well. Mm-hmm. For some of you guys and roses, you holding on to somebody, a fire sign or something. But like I said, you look at somebody like they're stable and beautiful. You know, you have emotions for this um, song, this um, person you're interested in. Mm -hmm. She could be a go-getter too as well. Yeah. You're trying to manifest somebody back too, guns. Yeah. For some of you guns and roses, like I said, y'all um, ended, you know, being a player. And y'all really watching somebody and y'all want to be with somebody. And it's definitely another fire sign like you. And that's for some. You think this rose is very beautiful. You love to make uh, have passion with her because two fire signs together make some great love. Oh, yes. And you've been thinking about this rose a lot because you know she's really, really beautiful. She's sexy. She dresses nice. She keeps herself up. She's well kept. Plus, most of all, you attracted to her because she's a go-getter and she'll go get that bag no matter what. You might not even be talking to her, neither Saggies, my guns, but you ready to go offer your love to her too as well. Mm-hmm. For some of you guns and roses, this rose could be at a distance from you. Yeah, you really um you want to travel to see her because this guns and this rose make you happy. Yeah, for some of you guys, y'all been really, really working hard. Y'all might work all the time, but y'all focused on y'all money so y'all can save up so y'all can go see this person. And y'all know this person that y'all love is stable. Somebody that you're dealing with, you could be dealing with two uh, people, but somebody's income is greater than the other one, and that's who you're looking at, the one who's more stable.